So, so Professor, now if you look at the past, in 2021, we were all aware that the NMRA database was deleted. Whether it was done accidentally or whether it was done purposely, we are still, we don't know yet because there's a court case on that pending at the, at the moment. Do you think that also had contributed uh, to the problems in the health crisis at present? Very much. I mean, that's why we are trying to say it's multifactorial. I mean, you can't pinpoint that single point. I mean, uh, in, a, in a health system like Sri Lanka, which has been well established, for it to have a crisis situation, it has to fail in many, many situations. So all these areas, so that would in involve administration, purchasing, procurement, decision making, policy making, all these areas, all these areas need to, need to be affected. And that, that cannot happen accidentally. It cannot happen accidentally. And, so, and so clearly there isn't even one person with an ounce of in integrity and honesty among all these dozens to whom these documents have been copied. Yes, I mean, the concern in fact is this has, these points have been raised many times. This has, from, I mean, uh, from 2022, I suppose, in 2022, during the economic crisis, Sri Lanka Medical Association is, issued a statement and several others also issued statements. So, this has been pointed out. So, 